Hello everyone and welcome to another movie review. Today I'm reviewing the movie Mary Poppins. Now this was released on August 27th, 1964. It is a fantasy musical movie that received overwhelmingly positive reviews with critics. It has a 7.8 out of 10 on IMDb, which I think is really low. It has a rare 100% on Rotten Tomatoes and a 91% on Google. Now, this movie had a $6 million budget and made $102.3 million at the box office. And this was directed by Robert Stevenson and written by Bill Walsh and Don DeGrotti. And it's based on uh, the book series by P.L. Travers. And this movie stars Julie Andrews, Dick Van Dyke, uh, uh, Matthew Garber, Karen Dotrice, and David Tomlinson. And this movie basically cleaned up at the Oscars. Uh, had 13 Oscar nominations, and it won five four of which went for Best Score, Best Song, Best Visuals, and Best Film Editing. And Julie Andrews won the Oscar for her performance, and she also took home a Golden Globe for her performance. Uh, and there were three other nominations for Golden Globes, and they had two Grammy wins as well. Uh, and of course, a sequel will be coming out soon, Mary Poppins Returns which really looks good. Um, I'm looking forward to that one too. But Mary Poppins is a simple movie. Uh, she returns to look after the bank's children. And in doing so, they have many adventures. Um, the uh, cinematography is spectacular in this movie. When they're in the... Uh, animated worlds and they're singing and dancing it's so perfect i love when they mix animation and live action movies together uh, this is one of the first to do it if not the first to do it i believe but it is a fantastic movie filled with great characters great songs great dancing just everything across the board is perfect with this movie there's not a whole lot else you can say about it, uh, except it's about time we got a sequel. Uh, and although Julie um, uh, Andrews won't be returning uh, for this movie, uh, the people who they selected to play these roles uh, are excellent. And of course, uh, Meryl Streep's appearing in it, but the big box office draw Dick Van Dyke is going to be in the movie as well. So I'm looking forward to that. And uh, it's going to take me back to my childhood. Even though this movie was made way before I was born, it is uh, one of my personal favorites growing up. And uh, it's just a spectacular film. It's great for uh, families uh, and just adults or kids. Uh, it's great for all. It's something that... People of the day should really watch and, you know, take something from the movie. Uh, but other than that, there's not a whole lot else to say about this movie, except if you haven't seen it, you definitely have to check it out. Especially if you are looking forward to uh, this uh, sequel. But other than that, I give Mary Poppins, of course, a 10 out of 10 and two thumbs up. What else do you think I was going to do with it? So in the comment section below, tell me. If you've seen this movie, give me your thoughts and opinions. And are you looking forward to the sequel? Let me know in the comment section below. Also, this is considered to be uh, Walt Disney's best movie. Do you agree with that? Let me know in the comment section below. For me, I would say it's up there. It's not personally my favorite Disney movie, but it is a fantastic movie at that. But other than that, I thank you guys for watching and supporting my channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share these videos with all your family and friends. And I will see you guys next time on the next movie review. Check you later.